behind yeah. after everything yeah. went down. So this is exhausting. Oh, yeah, it certainly is. Ed. Oh, look, it's that yeah. type of druid that has uh, wild growth again. Yeah, that, that's uh, every, every druid I know. Yeah, it seems so. At the end you of don't the have day to mully for that. It's like, so I have wild growth. Yeah, so what <laughs> mid-range cards can I keep? <laughs> what isn't too greedy? Here? Yeah. It does change so much. Like, the, the difference between just top decking it and actually just starting with it before you mulligan is, yeah. is pretty big. Although, it actually, it feels better sometimes when you just draw it and it perfects It is more curve. satisfying. And then you say, yeah. greetings. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I actually do, like, three well plays with that, but I don't play Druid that much. Sure, sure. No. Say, that right, say, say that right now. Oh, I don't play it. Druid much at all. I don't like Druid, man. Yeah, I, I do find it pretty boring, but it's... I don't know. I, I think it's a cool class. I just hate Innervate. It's just... Um, yeah, I hate Innervate, and I hate Wild Growth. And I, I hate playing I on Curve. I didn't want Innervate in the games. I just like Hero Power Pass. Oh, yeah, the Innervates have not been really being drawn. I don't know. It's kind of weird. Maybe just substitute Innervate with uh, Wild Growth. So you have four oh, Wild Growth. Yeah, oh, that was my plan. Good. You can gang up your Wild Growth spell? Yeah, gang up Wild Growth. <laughs> Pretty good, That'd right? be a pretty cool secret. Like, the next spell your opponent plays, shuffle like 10 copies of in your deck. 10. Why stop at 3? Three? 3's just not enough. Wow. Because if you can't pick what it is, you need to flood your deck with it. I'm just thinking of having, like, imagine that, then Shaman would be really good because they have, like, Totem Might. Imagine that. No, you, no you want like 10 sprints in the deck, so you just have a hand of, like, 6 sprints. <laughs> you, you just can sprint, never get rid you of You sprint into 4 more sprints. <laughs> yeah. That would Someone be sick actually uh, checked how many cards do you, you can have in your deck with Malorn. Yeah. Before the gang up was introduced, it was like sixty, I think, eighty. I've, wait, wait, what? It's something like that. Yeah, you, there's like there's a card oh. cap for a deck, but I've seen it broken before. So maybe it's something that's. Wait, how would you even do that? How would you break the card cap? How does this work? What? Um, you, you copy Malorns, like. Yeah. Infinite. Copy like how copy? I'm confused. Um, you can, yeah, for one, you can copy. For two, I think you can uh, kill Malorn off with a Baron Geddon and so you put two in your deck. Options. I'm pretty sure. You could also have, like, uh, a double KT. Oh, okay, yeah. KT. Okay, this makes more sense. Yeah. Now. I was, like, very confused for saying, like, what are you even talking about? Okay, yeah, yeah. So, uh, there is an innervate for you, though, Lothar. It's going to be oh, able to innervate really? that Lanch Ancient of Lore next so. turn. That's cool. That's, uh, that's a really good turn of free play. Yeah. Turn three. <laughs> but that's also good. Like six six creature on turn three, it's also good. Yeah. Kind of okay, right? Dude, you gotta. People have to start teching abusive sergeant to go with this BGH man. And that's I was like, I always tech. like that. Yeah. I just go dark iron. <laughs> dark iron. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> turn seven. Yeah. Oh. oh. But the, where's the keeper when you need it? Yeah. Seriously. Well, I probably draw it next turn. Don't worry. Mm. Well, I think we're going to see a uh, Blood Mage uh, Eviscerate here. I would be pretty surprised if we didn't see that. It's not too hard to find. I well, I, He's I like think, in between two of them. I think Sap is reasonable, but you just don't have anything to follow with Sap. Yeah. No, it seems like Blood Mage Eviscerate is just like a million percent better than anything yeah. else. I agree. Imagine if he went for like Sap with that. Blood Mage Sap. Yeah. The Sap does one more damage. He already has combo, so if he draws Emperor, he can go nuts. I think he has to just clear that board. I think if you slow down the game, you basically guarantee a win. Yeah, <laughs> something like that. So I mean, the left, hand actually right? isn't that bad for Zlay, though. Yeah, it's it's not so bad. It looks fine. It's fine, but it's not like crazy. Like He's yeah. not even using a charge on his weapon. The problem is you use the swipe, and then the Violet Teacher comes, uh, comes down. Yeah. But yeah. it doesn't get anything next turn, probably, so that's good. But the druid also lacks turn. Oh, no, no wait, never mind. Because, I mean, you're yeah, just going to play Alright, well, let's say you don't swipe. What are you playing? Yeah, <laughs> you have no choice. You have to swipe and grab. BGH hero no, power. You can, you can force a nature and trade with. <laughs> <laughs> that's a great play with two Savage Roars in your hand. Yeah. I think that's. You know what, Crip? I'm going with that. I think that's what Hype's going to do. do and I think Hype's going to win this tournament after that. It's, it's one for one. Yeah, it's it's perfect mana. Six drop on turn. I think six. of how many spells you had to play to get this to be a six six. Yeah, that's crazy. All right, so he does Lothar's play. 
Oh, I, I preferred yours though, Crip. Okay. That was so unique. Yeah. <laughs> so I don't think you actually have a teacher. I think you uh, shred. Yes. Yeah, shred. I agree with that. Vile teacher is too vulnerable. I uh, there's. I don't think you need tokens right now, and you don't like what you, prep fan. No, get out. Yeah. It's a shredder turn. Definitely. Next thing you can sap whatever comes down. And keep the prep for the sprint. You can sap the engine again, right? You don't care about that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's it's too slow to At just keep playing. Hard drives, it. Like, it doesn't matter. Yeah, it's irrelevant. You can mill him. I think you actually <laughs> No, I think you actually violate teacher sap. Yeah. Yeah, totally. Yeah, totally. Can you do more than that? You think it's worth like prep of this just to get more tokens? I, I think, it I think it's so important to get that crucial blade flurry with additional points of damage when you draw the uh, deadly poisons or tinkers, or even Pay if you draw a sprint. Yeah, I. Oh, he's actually gonna go ahead and just kill it straight. I, I okay. don't like this at all. You dish so much damage to a creature with, which you didn't to have to hmm. deal with. I think it's only four damage that you lose. But only you lost. Much. You lost already. One eviscerate, so you have no more eviscerate. I, I was thinking of just eviscerating face just to get the token, so... Like, I, I actually like the sap a little bit more. I mean, Zelaya is a million I, percent better than me, but like... I think sap is good. I, I just I think, think that HLR is too slow to just keep playing, you know? Yeah. I think I went with the sap too, but I mean, I can't, I can't really disagree with that. Yeah. I mean, look at his board, and there was already a swipe used, so you probably think he doesn't have a swipe here. Yeah, well, okay. If he has a sense. swipe, you're like, oh, okay, I guess you're better than me. Well, what does he have? Druid is kind of screwed. Really? Uh, what if he does shade yeah. and then Druid of the Cloth face puts him to 24 with a shade? And you count on drawing the second innervate? Um, that wouldn't do it, though, because yeah. he's only going to oh. be at 9. No, 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 you kill it. You kill him next. Oh, 9, never mind. Yeah, yeah. but well, you, have, at 10. you have this shade. Uh, and you probably won't die next turn. No, that doesn't no, make you're, sense. No, you're not going to die next turn. Well, I mean, we can see he won't die, but like, even here, I don't think I would think that I'm going to die, most likely. You'd have to have like exactly the right hand. Be like five off these, that still kind of sucks. What to do? Time waits for like, no one. Taunt is not better than charge. Toshly hero power, go. No, no I, so I like slow. the Druid uh, Shade. I think Druid and Taunt might be like, yeah. a little better, but it's not going to work out better. Oh, he's Toshly here, Look at that. Oh, you could actually just... Oh, that's nice. Toshly, more like Taunt. Too bad there's a sap Sapley. waiting. Sapley? It's just going to give him another spare part. Blade That's fine. I you know. Rack up on those. <laughs> so you drop the Drake, right? Look at that hand size, man. I bet he wishes he had a Fell Reaper right now. So many options. Um, really? I think Wayfair is pretty decent there. I'm ready to learn. Okay, Sap. Yes, yeah, it's, it's too slow. It's too good not to Sap, you're right. Yeah. Toshly is so slow. It's like a Sylvanas or something. Wow. This game is over. Yes. Zelay just crushing right now. Crush that well. So, <laughs> we come to a conclusion that the sap was better this turn than the last turn. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. But, uh, even sap worked out. So, you know, force of nature concede. No, you're you're not dead. Um, what? You can get a doomsayer. You can get a second swipe. You can get a doomsayer, that's true. I guess that is what you go for, too. No, it's a swipe is, you're still dead with swipe. Your play is doomsayer. Yeah. So you how many how many two mana minions are there? Like Druid hmm, 27 or something? 68. 68? Is it God, 68? Where did I come minions? up with 27? <laughs> Excuse me, what? Two mana minions? 67. Okay. No, no, there's like seven of them. There's Doomsayer, there's Millhouse Mana Storm, there's their Succubus, there's Lightwell. Oh yeah, that's that's nice. Lore yeah, Walker no, there's Cho. there's Lorewalker Cho, Matt Pagel. And explosive sheep. There's yeah. There's seven <laughs> two drop minions. And there's, there's and don't tell me anything else because that's all I've ever seen out of him. Haven't you seen whirling zapmatic when you're at six life? Actually, I have seen a whirling zap. That's super rare though. <laughs> and that's uh, like a one in sixty-seven card. Double savage roar or double rogue biter for that. <laughs> oh, Bagel. Not you're Bagel. right. Yeah, you're right. 
One and seven. Yeah. I told you. I know what I'm talking about. It's 15%. All right. <laughs> You're getting there. It's closer. I'm getting there. It's closer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. So, uh, well done there by Zelay. Yeah. Nice, strong first win. I We've actually seen Rogue get pretty wrecked on uh, on our stream so far. And uh, winning the first game with it seems pretty good because in the Conquest format, you just have to win one. True. Yeah. Uh, well, what were the bans? I actually, we don't have the bans. We have what their decks uh, were. but uh, I can assume it's both Hunters. As it could be. Last time Hyped actually banned Zelay's Mage because he wasn't sure what it was. Yeah, but now he knows for sure. Oh, it was played on the other stream? I, I don't know, but I would guess so. I yeah, I would imagine it probably was. So <laughs> If it was Freeze Mage, he may have still banned that because that's what he was saying he was a little bit nervous about. Mm -hmm. Oh, there was a Hunter, Hunter from Oh, okay, so... Zelay. So he did ban You know what? Yeah, yeah, I think Hyped okay. banned the Mage again, Oh, maybe probably. the Shaman. Oh, he could have. He was saying that that just like shreks him pretty hard on his druid. But well, when you have double mech warper, he was talking. To you. Yeah, well, that was a ridiculous draw. Oh, look, another face. It is a face hunter. So, so you have to get. I always assume that hunter's gonna keeper. be a druid. So you keep the innervate, keep the wrath. Uh, That's where's the wild growth? You don't need wild growth against hunter. Yeah, you need keeper. He does need Keeper. Okay. But I would keep the Wrath and the Innervate here. Mm -hmm. okay. And I would just be like, all right, come on, Keeper. You have two turns to go. keep a Wolf Rider? So it's, you know. Oh, Hunter? Yeah, it looks pretty decent to keep. I would definitely keep Leprino and... Oh, yeah. Glaive Zuka. Glaive yeah, Zuka. Those, those yeah. But do you keep the Wolf Rider? That's nah, I don't think so. You you, can, you usually play the Wolf Rider on turn five. Yeah, I would rather get like another one drop or something, I think. Yeah. I don't think it's terrible. I don't think it's terrible to keep it. Okay. But like, when you play against Druid, you want to. That's a golden hunter, by the way. He's oh no he's way! He's done this face game a few thousand times. Yeah. Well, it's I can imagine Druid too. So imagine how many Druids of the Claw he has played. <laughs> think about that for a moment. Okay. <laughs> more charges or more taunts? What do you guys think? Uh, charges. Roman. More charges. Yeah. Taunts. No, I, I go with the charges. taunts actually. Well, I mean, you raise it in, up mostly in, on the ladder, ladder, right? In ladder, I usually just like zerg people down. You zerg them down! Oh, That's man. That's what they try to do to you. I, I just love the terminology. All right. That's the usual thing what you want to do against the druid and when you play face hunter. You drop those one health minions to push druid into, um, like, ab avoiding efficient mana usage from yeah. the druid. So he has to use his hero power every single turn. Mm -hmm. There's another one. Oh, there's that Wolf Rider. This will be rad. That was definitely the best play. <laughs> oh, that's the Keeper. Ooh. But the, now he just wraps. You think Wrath over... Yeah. You wrath, the draw keeper? a card, yeah. And hmm. No, no, no. no. Y you have to keep the Innervate now um, to make a, an example. Ancient War or something. Like Every combo or whatever. And okay. the draw. How does Face Hunter deal with Tasha? Hunter's Mark. It's knife not juggler not knife. Not that many people are playing Hunter's Mark. Oh, looks like not today at least. Yeah, just Rain yeah, so far yeah. that I've seen. That wasn't really. You can hunter. play Drake yeah. now, and you should. Oh wow! Yeah, a second innervate. That's sick. Yeah, so the <laughs> savage roar. <laughs> Two to face. <laughs> that was actually it. That was pretty good. Top deck that. You have two turns planned. Yeah. Like easily. Look at this. Look at his curve. Four, five, six, and then on seven, you Savage Roar with another Turn six might be different, because if you have three creatures on board, you can just yeah. go Savage Roar and yeah. burst the damage. But Toshly, he's a sniper rifle. And that face hunter draw is not good at all. You can't spare the damage for minions on, uh, against Druid, because then you lose. Yeah, they have too much health usually. Yeah, so you just have to go face with everything yeah. you can. Yeah. And you have two weapons. So it's actually better now to use the Eagle Home Bow and then go face with Eagle Home Bow next turn and probably play Glaive Zuka and Hero Power. Yeah. But this means... Man. Hyped will stack damage so fast. Yeah, Hyped is just crushing face right now. This is really rough. Okay, this is where you actually... You, you quick shot this four three and you it gets you the doomsayer that we've been talking about. Let's yeah, that's that's a one in seven. So mm -hmm. hmm. Well, still if you want to win, I think you have to go with the bow attack 
Leif Zuka, Hero Power. But that's eight. No. God. If you want to win, I, I think you have to do it. Mm -hmm. I don't see... A, a, how do you win if you, an example, now trade for the for the piloted shredder, or, or you just quick shot it? It doesn't really matter because you count on a one to twenty outcome for yeah. a positive thing for you. Lothar. Oh, face. Yeah. Wow. All I right. Yeah. That. No, he's going for it. Okay, that's better than yeah. 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 He's just he's saving in case he gets a charge minion. Like a Wolf Rider is a pretty sick draw. Like Arcane Golem is a pretty sick draw. Yeah, that's a good one too. Well, not not now. Yeah, that's yeah. a taunt minion right what? there. You need uh, an Owl. With an Owl, you lose. That one Sludge Belcher just tank tanked like 8 points of damage. Yeah, it's not even just Sludge Belcher. It's the Where fact that there's a... Uh, oh. oh! Oh, wow! wow. He's, so he's like set serious. Up. He's setting up lethal next to him. Yeah. He knows there's so. no way that oh. Hunter can kill him. What's the maximum damage output that Hunter can do for five points of uh, for five points no, of mana? It's, it's Arcan Golem double Avers of Sergeant, right? That's the maximum you can dish out. Yeah, eight. Mm. There has to be something more. No, I mean he could do. That. Yeah, no, yeah, that's it. That is eight. You're right. So, Huck Hunters, no, right? <laughs> <laughs> Took me a moment. Yeah, I mean, that's just, it's lethal, like, no matter what here. Yeah. Well played, Unless but you Well, here you, if you think he has Savage Roar, I guess you could kill Command this 4-3 and hope that you get that, uh... <laughs> no, he will just kill Command's no, place. of course. Oh, never mind. I think he's still dead. Yeah, he is dead. Yeah, yeah. If the Savage Roar oh, just kills really him straight. really dead now with Swipe. Oh, no, it doesn't. No, it's... Even cast both. The Swipe doesn't kill him at all, I think. Yeah. But it's there for expanding. It is. You need it later. Just in case he lived past that somehow. Yeah. So that went fast. Yeah, I know. These two are actually crushing each other. This is kind um, of brutal. N yeah. It's a 1 1. Hyped is preparing to battle a friend, waiting for the next game to start. Huh. So, uh, Hyped here probably has. Because we don't know the band still, because we're not looking for some reason. It's you have to like lean over on this. It's Mage and Rogue. It's a big lean, man. It's it's a late. big lean, and it's been a long day. Yeah. And I don't have any big leans left in me. I All certainly right. don't. Game's starting up. Let's see it. All right, he's going Shamanizer. right back. To so he room. didn't ban the shaman, so no. he had to ban the mage. Yeah. Again. Interesting. Yeah. So Zale Zale has to play the freeze mage, right? Otherwise, he wouldn't ban it. Uh. Well, hype said he doesn't know. So it's possible that we Frodan banned the mage? Frodan, yeah. yeah, I'm not sure, because obviously Hyped would have asked Frodan. Yeah. So, which means probably, I would guess that Frodan probably didn't ban the mage, and it was Freeze. So he's like, okay, it's Freeze. So then yeah, Hyped would ban it again, because he doesn't want to play against that. So that makes sense. Hmm. So you play against a mech shaman, and what do you look for? Deadly no? poison, blade flurry. Yeah, yeah. You gotta so get the you blade just mulligan everything away. I think uh, you know Zillia has double fell reaver, and that's not a creature you can like afford to leave on the board. But double fell reaver is like you play against handlock, and you need an eviscerate fell nose backstab to deal with that. Well, that's that's my point. You, like you kind of need sap as well. I don't like this at all. Keeping those free. That was actually a little bit surprising, huh? Okay. Well. Well, we have a turn two mech warper, three power mace, four fell reaver, but that that mech warper. Don't you like live. turn two uh, hero power into a power mace attack phase or kill an agent of ours here? Yeah. No, I like mech warper. To like get that. to get a bigger mech warper on turn four, and hero power. Huh. I, I would like that. Point of deadly poison. Because yeah. now you lose the mech warper with like. No outcome. And you don't have to rush the, the rogue, to be honest. That's a lava burst. I just realized that. <laughs> yeah, that is a lava burst, you're right. I guess plan, uh, Zalia's plan is to add Leather Shock on the top 8. Huh. 
<laughs> That's it's just gonna be two cards different on round of eight if he makes it there. Yeah. Okay. So well. now it's power maze at yeah. that phase. Yeah, I like power maze phase. Yeah, but now it makes sense Even because he drew the pilot treasure. Yeah. Well, I mean, he has a lot of mechs in this deck, so he probably. I think this is like almost as many mechs he could possibly fit into a shaman. Yeah, it seems that way at least. I mean, I've seen Mech Shaman, but I've never seen Fell Reaver even in Mech Shaman. That's that's too. Yeah, but yeah, I it makes seen sense. It. You don't. You can't draw cards in Mech Shaman. Yeah. Basically, it's even worse yeah. than Mech Mage. In Mech Mage, you can use maybe the other Mech, Mech Mage has reasonable sustain with some draws. It, well, he has Mirror Entity. It is basically like a draw. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And he has Mech Scientist, which is also then you like have a draw. Azure Drake, which is like actually a draw. Yeah, but most people are cutting uh, the yeah. Azure Drake, but I, I Mad, Mad, scientist, I Mad Scientist is just a draw and three points of mana, most of the time. So this is why you play Fallow Reverse in the Shaman. Makes sense. Yeah. Good call. Yeah, that is really cool, actually. Is this the exact match that so opened up the, their options. first game in their first matchup no, no, earlier? No. It was against uh, a Druid, Druid, right? yeah, and yeah. he just like really super crushed it with that. Without a so. MC tech, it's unwinnable. Yeah, yeah. Or innervate shenanigans turn one. Yeah. Or t turn two, Doctor Boom. It doesn't seem like it, it it's doable at all. Oh, he didn't attack. The, no, he that's that's crazy. really interesting. I mean. Um, Zalei so didn't attack on turn three. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I was a little bit confused about that because it'd be nice to get the pilot. Well, going. he plays around sap. This way. Yeah. What so he will just do? drop the pilot shredder and now attack face. Mm, no. no. Oh, he does. Oh. Yeah, okay. Because now, um, hyped has to play the sap to avoid. Debuffed attack, right? Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, that makes sense. He doesn't want to buff ahead of time, I guess. Sure. Yeah. Hmm. So that does make sense then. Let's see what. Drop a mech. Oh, that's not One bad. Free. That's not bad. You can buff your, sh uh, your totems. Yeah, that's true. Or win fury creatures. Oh, that's awesome. Or you could make the Fell Reaver a 9 attack. So sick. So the thing is, if he actually plays Fell Reaver, he's going to lose a considerable portion of his deck immediately. <laughs> Crip, why doesn't th that Fell Reaver doesn't have a stealth? Uh, actually, that's kind of funny, yeah. In, in World of Warcraft, you'd always be like doing some, some dumb quest in Hellfire Peninsula, and this Fell Reaver, which was like mm. more than the size of what you could see on your screen, yeah. <laughs> and more levels than you could realize and like defeat, would just like literally stomp on you. So it was like an ultimate enemy or something? It like was. It just roamed around the like great some newbies out. No life Kriparian beat it? Yeah, you beat it when you're like max level with good gear. But really? at that level is so literally Did you ever go possible. back and get revenge? Oh yeah, of course. Oh, okay, good. But it's 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 kind of hilarious. Um, it was it was one creature that people could only um, like realize was around them if they had game game sounds on. Oh, really? Like this really, like ridiculous... like. I guess kind of like a sounds. train sound or something, but a lot of people wouldn't play with sound. They'd just be like killing some boar in Hellfire Peninsula, and then just get absolutely crapped on by Fell Reaver. That's awesome. they just like step on him in one shot, and like from behind. I like stuff like that. <laughs> Look at that. 5-4 Zapomatic. You have to deal. kill that. <laughs> I would say so. So, so um, do you want to prep here? Drake prep Eviscerate? Kinda of sucks. No, no, no. Why not use Blood Mage here? So well, Blood Mage. The Blood Mage doesn't achieve anything. Well, no, because you can get with your Phantom Knives, you can get rid of this four too. But you. Uh, okay, you mean to use yeah. the prep too? Yeah. That oh. Let's use oh, your hand, man. It's cool. I'm tired, you know. Yeah, no, we all are. It's really, really late. Overkill by one. Second power maze. That's cool. You can get a 10-10. No, it's Fell Reaver time. 11. Yeah, Fel Reaver time, ten. boys. It's definitely Fell Reaver time. That Fell Reaver's going to step on him. He doesn't even know he's there. <laughs> Should have had the game sound on. I Should have had Funny enough, party. it was actually rogues that probably escaped Fell Reaver the most. Oh, really? They, like, stealthed around and stuff. Yeah. How many times did it actually kill you? 
Oh, I don't know, like ten. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's kind of exact crazy. number. But you, you couldn't even kill that thing if you were max level with like decent gear most of the time. Oh, that's awesome. I I like stuff like that. That's uh, that almost makes me want to play that game. I think they just nerfed that content so hard that I'd probably kill it about that level now. Yeah. Yeah. You know, it's old content. Yeah. So he's thinking about lava shocking what? the Drake, right? No, oh, no. no. If I you fell, fell Reaver, you just trade. run the the four two in. It's your last. Drink. Oh yeah, right. You, I was like looking at the Cogmaster. Why does yeah. it have a bob with two? Yeah. Right. I actually don't understand why there would be any decision making. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I think he's just right. being really careful because he really wants to go forward. Yeah. Maybe he's bluffing that he has decent plays with <laughs> those two cards. And look, it is the nine. Well, I mean, I that about. that was a decent play. It's, yeah. There's no bluff required. <laughs> I mean, with the other cards. Yeah. And um, hype is kind of. He's in trouble. Yeah, I wanted to say something different, but yeah, so that, that's better. Yeah, that's uh, a PG way of saying it. You Drake. He needs to fan into a sap. That's what he needs. Ah, oh, that's awful. No, that'd be great, man. How, how many cards does he have in the deck? Let me see. Uh, 19. And he's so used one sap, so he's got a 1 in 19 chance. He used one sap? When? No, he hasn't. Not in this game. Oh, the last game. Or a different game. So I don't know. I've watched a lot of rogues sap a lot of stuff. So today. what is yeah, the that's percentage that's of draw because, the sap? Uh, that's because the rogues Two out don't of 19, tend to win man, their that's conquest like game. That's 10%. More than 10%, even. Jeez. Yeah, usually when it's more than 10, Jeez. I just go with 11. Just pretend <laughs> to be smart. <laughs> 11%. <laughs> 11. That sounds good to me. Yeah. God, Yo, he really waits. Mines. Hyped is freaking me out. Oh. Oh, that's 10 points of damage. So that's lethal next turn? Three? No. S how many points of damage is Lava Shock? Five? <laughs> yeah, it's five. <laughs> it can be tricky. We haven't seen that card in a long time. <laughs> it's one of the... <laughs> wait, wait, but if he rolls a spell power totem, it's lethal, right? No. Uh, six <laughs> plus nine plus, plus, plus one plus three? That sounds like lethal to but, me. But, you, but that's chat Not lethal with uh, one mana too much. Oh, yeah, you're right. Okay. So he needs to have already played a Tarzan. Huh. I think the play is pretty simple. I think you just um, go face. Yeah, I think you totem first. Actually, I think you totem first, then you whirling zapomatic power mace. I think you kill the one one Thalnos because the one spell damage yeah. can make a big difference here. Mm -hmm. Definitely true. But you can, s you should set up lethal for next turn. I'll attack it for nine. I, I think just that. hitting nine face and yeah. power mace development is setting up lethal. Might be this case. Oh, yeah. I might, that, that might be the case. Yeah. Oh, look, you can even heal. You've nailed it, Chris. The yeah. sword smith. Yeah, that is a scary amount of damage. Holy crap, that is definitely lethal next turn. Well, he has antique heal ball, let's see. That doesn't save him. Oh, boy. Unless he draws a sap. Yeah, it doesn't save And, nope. Um, hmm. Then you can't bleed through anything. Nope. This is really painful. Mm. Look at that healing taught. He's ready to do damage too. You, He's ready to go you to have battle. to uh you have to uh, fanonize. But you still most likely dead. Okay, so he's gonna just try to draw a sap. Yeah, but that's not good enough. We know that's not good enough. <gasps> Follow ah. Alright. So that's two one? Yep. Yeah. The I'm Again, kind of scared the about rogues this shaman. really struggling. Like for almost everyone. Dude, this shaman deck is actually doing pretty well so far today, too. By I way. think there's also like there's a trend that we've been seeing with rogues. Yeah. They're not playing a specific card that may or may not be very good. Which is? <laughs> Innervate? You're right. No one is playing Gang Up Rogue. Oh. Okay. And after our one four performance this morning at I, rank ten I, on the I ladder. Just, I just remember everyone in the room saying how Oil Rogue is just too good not to use, and then this happens. I think they were saying Gang Up Rogue was too bad to use. I think that was closer to what the message was. You know, I, I think there was. I think 
I think my, my message might be a direct quote from uh, at least one person. Who? I don't know. Someone. <laughs> could be, though. Yeah, someone could have said that. <laughs> we don't really have original thoughts in our heads. Humans have been around for like a million years, man. Someone said this before. <laughs> All right. Looks like it's next okay. one is going to be Hunter up against Rogue. I have to restart okay. the second Goodbye, Rogue. client. Could be. If he had over 100 points of heal like we did this morning, though. Yeah, he might win. He might be able to do it, but I don't see a single gang up in this deck. Nope. How are you ever going to do it? Mm, it's pretty decent. Yeah. Prep fan deadly poison. Whoa. Yeah, not bad. You can get a nice spaghetti one. So many options. That's really. I need to turn. That's uh, that might be winning turn when you drop the huge advent on turn three. Yeah. Or the really huge advent on turn four. Mm. Yeah. Turn four is really big, but I don't think you can afford to wait. No, uh, you have to drop it. Drop it like it's hot. Mm, yeah. <laughs> Look at how you pretend like he might do something here. Oh, that's so sweet. The pretending is the best guy. part. Yeah. It's basically like I'm playing against them in arena right now. So <laughs> many. I can only imagine what were you saying when I was thinking about the turn one play at Mech Mage with three one drops. Um, actually, I think there was reasonable and a strategy in that one, but I don't think if you pick like the best one, yeah. it didn't work out to be the best at least. <laughs> that that was fact. Yeah. I kind of like this play. You like the attack? Yeah. Because if you're prepping something, it's probably not deadly poison. No, certainly. <laughs> So if, you uh, drop you, you're definitely putting him on Phantom Knives here. If Hyped fails to advance, that's that's 0-3 for Tempo Storms. Ooh. Actually, Who did don't worry, Gara plays tomorrow. Yeah, He'll Gaara for sure plays. advance. <laughs> but Gara has not touched the Kuparian yet. Did the other guys touch you? No, but Gara's done the touch the Kuparian thing in both the last time I've casted him, and yeah. he's he's so the best like options. best finisher. Yeah, best finisher in both. Uh. It was um, first in Bucharest. Yeah. yeah. And uh, first non Chinese at WCA. That's true, yeah. yeah. Good moves, good moves. Yeah, very much so. Here comes that one of Hunter's Mark that we've never seen before in Zelle's Hunter. <laughs> Is this game frozen over here? Oh, wow. I think so. Come wow. on. Oh, that's nice. That's insane. Yeah, that's a good draw. I think Otherwise, that we actually froze over on this screen. Yeah, I think so. I think so. we got to okay. rejoin that. If you, yeah. Go Top that. dicked. Look at that. <laughs> that's just unfair, man. Mm. Height, height is getting just beat up right now. By the way, Edwin and the World of Warcraft TCG was broken as hell. Was he? Yeah. And he, his price, like in you know, single shops, no, were won. about $200 okay. for one card. What? Yeah. He better have been golden. No, he wasn't. But promo, Edwin, was like $500. Oh, my God. Oh, no, was there a promo? I'm like, I can't remember. I but the, so. the normal one was broken Did you have hell. one? Everyone had four. Four Edwins. If if you wanted to be competitive, everyone had four. Yeah, that's like eight hundred dollars. Yeah, just four cards. That's expensive. Yeah. I had some very expensive magic decks myself, but that's like, that's pretty high up there. Mm. And people that's complain about hearts and being paid to win, right? Serious. Well, I mean, well, you want to play real pay to win, yeah. man. You try some of the things that aren't online cards. I definitely spent more on magic than Hearthstone. <laughs> man, how much money I spent on wool. I mean, TCG. Better not to think about it. Alright. Well, it looks like File Teacher's mm. pretty good. So it looks hey, like he's gonna play class. File Teacher. Oh, there he goes. File that Advent is so sad. 
That is what he said. Mm -hmm. Trade for the owl. Look at all those weapons. He needs to calm down on these weapons, man. God. I think so I you like, dropped uh, the Glaive Zuka yeah, I think and I the like second Glaive Zuka quick shot. Yeah, of course. So. No, I like Glaive Zuka quick shot. To yeah. trade. What if you want to draw it, Unleash the Helms? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> With this man? No, no, no. It's definitely Glaive Zuka quick shot here. Very uh, careful, deliberate play here from these guys, by the way. Yeah. They're definitely taking their time. <laughs> Look at Hyped oh, looking at that move again. <laughs> Before it goes off the screen, he's like, Ugh. That really He's like, I'm not going to go to the round of 16 because of that. This Edwin is not worth $200. <laughs> That's actually pretty funny. Because you know he's looking at it and he's like, Damn it. Like, <laughs> I'm not going to win any money at this event because of that owl. And he saw it come out as the card that was drawn to. He's like, oh. Yeah. And that owl is worth 20 dust. 20 dust. And that's a golden Van Cleave. You yeah. know what? You're right. I'm only going to play a basics only deck. It seems good. Owl is not basic. Owl's not basic? No, it's not. No, it's not. It's a common. That's why it's worth 20 dust. How much is a basic? Oh wait, you can't basic. Zero. Can't basic. Your power. <laughs> Bam. How did you know? Nailed it. Nailed it. Backstab. That's nice. That's always nice. Yeah, I have a feeling backstab's gonna be played this turn. You think so? Good you call. Might be right about That's that. A good chance. Yeah, good call. Better call Saul. So many options. Does he go for a race type situation here? Can Backstab, tinker. Well, attacking for a million. That will be lethal. Backstab the face. Can't. He's damaged. Oh. Oh, look. That's so bad. This is actually, he's very unlucky. I feel very bad for Soleil right now. I was already thinking with three weapons. I'm like, damn, I hate when that happens, but four. That's quad. That's four. You know how many turns this is going to take him? Six uh, turns one. to attack that many times. 800. Yeah. This game is going to be decided before that. Is it? Yeah, it is. Okay. Maybe there's a sabotage. Yeah. It can happen. I heard that card's good. That's true. That would mean that would only be five turns for him then. That's really great. It could be four if he does something foolish like play ahead of time. He could go... No, that would be so bad. Oh my god, that would be so bad. Yeah. He'd totally lose the sabotage because he'd only have four turns worth of face hits. <laughs> Definitely. Playing around possible gang ups by removing the, the heal bot. Hmm. Turn seven. But you can't really afford that, right? Do you race? I think you race. You just play yeah. Deadly Poison and yeah. Tinkers and go BOOM! Totally. That's so much damage. And you can Seven, even drop the Tefalnos just for 10, the draw. 13. I yeah, yeah. But afterwards, not first. It looks very lethally if you do it. And with all these weapons in hand, oh man. Go for it! Do it. Uh, can you can you stop rushing hype? Oh, sorry. Yes. Okay. I want hype to take his time. Tomorrow's life coach. Place. Prepare for that. <laughs> well, it, it <laughs> it's still a minute thirty. It is. It is. Sometimes it feels like longer. Yeah. But you have to fill that with words. Mm -hmm. That's a lot of damage, fellas. Perfect. That is a very easy lethal coming up. So And that is not a good draw. Do you draw Gladiator's Bowl? It's turn seven. And it would it would What hit. do you mean? That's that's a pretty good draw. What the it Oh is, yeah it, it is. is. The, it turns out the spiders make little dudes, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah that's pretty yeah, good. Yeah, that's nice. But you're most likely still dead. Um you're not dead to the to the hand, you're dead probably two draws, but yeah. yeah. 
Well, that's what I know. And the, the camera dude is spoiling. Well, here's here's what happens, guys. He plays Doctor Boom next. Oh. Oh no. Oh. Oh no. That's a disaster. Oh no. Now you're dead. Unless. Yeah. Now you're dead. Yeah. Now you're dead. Yeah. And there's a Drake. Please show us the next next draw. I want to see if it's, if it would be legal. It doesn't matter because you would probably have to play a charge minion to win, and then the knife would hit the boom bot, and it would it would have him. Sorry. <laughs> oh, that wouldn't be lethal. Yeah, but he has the Drake. He needs it. Oh, no, play it, play it, play it. We want to see it? Why oh, don't you draw the Drake? On. I wish this was like a traditional card game where you can just check your next yeah, cards. We actually talked about spectating but what should be added, and that was one of the options. Yeah, that I would be love added. to see my next card just oh. so I could get Hype even. Still angry. in it now. Two, two evened it up. Yeah. The fifth game? The rogue gets one. But uh, the hunter didn't, and that's that's something you don't really want to face too much of. No, I guess not. Um, What's left for Hyped? Uh, Mage, I think, yeah, right? We don't know the band, right? We don't actually know the band, but, I mean, they played each other before and he banned the hunter, so I'd imagine. <sighs> but actually, yeah, I don't know. Mm. I, I imagine that's it. Okay. If it's the Mage, then it's kind of even, right? Yeah. Unless, draws are. unless I think face Hunter, Hunter gets both med scientists really early on, gets the value from that. Yeah. We'll see. Mage. No oh, mage. Okay. All right. Oh, that's a good draw. Uh, yeah, that's a good draw because you guarantee those cards are yeah, you can back get into the deck. <laughs> 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 but most of the time, it happens happens like that. You mulligan those away and you draw them. In the yeah, first uh, turns. right away. That's like yeah. actually a rule of Hearthstone, the way that works. Yeah. And if you have two of it in your deck, it comes right back. You watch Second Harvest Golem right in the hand. Actually, I did some testing when I was so pissed about the draws in those situations. I put one golden card and one non golden card just to see if that's the same card with Molly. And it's and teasing it. you, right? Yeah, it's teasing. Yeah. All right. Um. So against the mage, I think you want to keep the eagle okay. home bow. Wait, wait, wait. I, I got to ask you guys something here, right? Because I look at this, the way that they both count down so long, and I feel like one of them is doing it in response to the other one doing yeah. it. That's who is the one that is actually the one deciding to do this, and who is the one that is deciding both. to do it in response? Because I feel, I, But one person decides. I, I feel like a lot of the time, like when I play a match, like, I'm all going at a reasonable rate, but if they're really slow, I'll be slow. Just be like, all right, you're not getting a leg up on me. You know what I mean? Yeah, I know. No. <laughs> no? I'm right. like, you know, I, I just sit there and I'm like, come on, man, come on. <laughs> you stream sniper? I mean, sometimes you wait a minute 30 against, like, someone who goes turn one and then just passes after, like, a minute 30. With well, one maybe mana. he was getting something to drink. Yeah, but look, when you go first with one mana and then don't play anything for a minute 30, it's, yeah, that's the most annoying for me. I wonder. Hello, hello, hello. That owl, pure value, mm -hmm. this time. Yeah, I think it's out. reasonable to actually kill the owl with the McWarper. Yeah, I think so, too. Totally. How do you deal one damage? With Hunter? Two wolf riders. Two wolf riders? Huh? The Annoyer truck. Uh, we were talking about the McWarper. Yeah. The one damage to the mech warper is kind of annoying. Unleash the house, man. Yeah, I suppose. Well, that's also okay. That's a pain. But you draw, you you drop the med scientist, right? Yeah. Oh no, you are King Goom. Oh, that's also great yeah. play. Mm -hmm. Tell him. It survives the hit. It takes the divine shield. Yeah, no, it's it's the one tanky minion in this deck, and it breaks the <laughs> mana usage of the of the uh, mate because he has to ping it. Yeah, his well, his yeah. curve gets messed up too because yeah. he might have a three drop he wants to do, and now he has to do like a ping or he has to do a four drop. Yeah, or he has to play the goblin blast mage, which just devastates a hunter. Oh wow, that's a passive turn. So Tinker Town technician. Ouch. Yeah. Of course. What's the plan here? You drop Mad Scientist Something Hero Power next turn. Or Mad Scientist Hunter's Creeper, but that's basically it. Next, no, he draws uh, Unleash. 
it's by game. far the best play. Oh yeah, you draw oh, the God. weapon because that's what you draw always. Yeah. If I didn't know better, he has like four of those eagle arm bows in there. <laughs> so the same as well. Four glaive zukas too. <laughs> yeah, four glaive zukas. I'm like, I don't know if you need that many. Do games even last that many turns that you could use all those? It's just such efficient like damage per card. Yeah. Especially when there's an Iotron. Well, not then. No. Did you think that an Iotron will be so powerful when you saw that uh, as a preview? I still think it's pretty what bad. To do? Oh, okay, never mind. Then. You're one of those guys? Yeah, I'm one of those guys. A great man once said that Mech Mage is just 28 cards and two Noetrons. That was the foot yeah. foothill, footman. Oh, never mind. Go try your footman. Yeah. I just, <laughs> I never, I never I play these like early that. game fight for the board type of decks. I always play control with like mid game board players. Do you players. play constructed? Yeah, when I do, I play like at at the very fastest level mid game controls with board clears. Yeah. I'm like a Neutron. Well, I guess I'll take two damage before all its friends die. <laughs> 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 so it's, it's all right. Hateful. Yeah. And then in Arena, Anoyatron very, very rarely does anything. It's just that uh, two threes have gone, gained a lot of favor in Arena. Because people pick stuff like Anoyatron. Hmm. Explosive trap. Alright. That's some. Uh, okay. It's a little charge. Now you can't even use the second Ignore Bowl. Yeah, seriously. That's a that's the real issue here. Oh, it's it's never. Like, so you want weapons? I'll give you weapons. <laughs> well, now you play clearing as face hunter, or do you go face? You're losing the race. Yeah, really, it looks like really it. badly. So you have to wolf rider into the four two. Yeah. Do what you about, play the leopardome, or do you use hero? What power? about killing the mech? Because you know, do you play around blast mage? I think you can't afford to. Yeah. yeah. It's just too much damage. No, you just you pretend won't. he doesn't have Blast Mage. True. Just tell yourself you top decked it. Blink when he when he plays out of his hand. It it looks very bleak for Zale. Yeah. And the beginning of the series looks so good. Yeah, but then he draw two weapons, man. Two yeah. weapons. No, At won't. least it wasn't four weapons, right? I have to say I don't. I'm not like, oh man, that's so unlucky to play face hunter and draw too many <laughs> weapons. <laughs> oh man, that sucks for him. <laughs> Ready to ride. Oh, that's right, like it. Yeah, he has to do it though. The hero power doesn't help anything because he's well, never Mac gonna Mage win a race. Mage doesn't care. Hmm. He's like, oh, I just dropped the blast mage and warring blade go face. You don't want to drop the clock gnome. It's just a. Something that will be useful on the hound. Yeah. Okay, that's unlucky. Yeah, that's actually very unlucky. Eh, yeah, go to face. Yeah, Whirling blade, go drop to the whirling blades and go face. You will draw a fireball next turn. Most likely. Yeah. And Hunter can't afford to clear with weapon. Yeah, that weapon do. is. So he has to use those uh, minions anyway. Yeah, there's no, no reason to ever drop clear. it. No. I think it's okay to drop that. I I do prefer the Whirling Blades just because like the one way you might be able to come back is a sick unleash. Yeah. Hmm, quick shot. That's not usable with that weapon. That's really really bad for Zale. Oh boy. Team so, Seer time. Yeah, I think so. Really? I wonder. It's what time? Doom Seer. Doom Seer. <laughs> That would be nice. That's that's the final level of desperation. I, I mean, I think I would actually arcane into this five four. You won't, mate. Huh? Never mind. You wouldn't arcane into the five four. First check for. The I think doomsayer. a quick shot. Oh, yeah, yeah the four three. Yeah, that's the first move, but then it doesn't give you doomsayer. Then what? Watch it gives explosive Mine sheep. Has a trumpet. Explosive sheep. Explosive that's sheep a, is great. That's two out of seven hmm. is actually a good move. Explosive Sheep is terrific. Yeah. Because the, the battle cry will trigger... Uh, oh, it doesn't go for it. Kind of interesting. Hmm. So it keeps the mech mage... Uh, I mean, keeps the mage for the mage. Okay. Okay, that makes sense. But 
I still think you can't win the race. Uh, I mean, he has a lot of damage output here. But but nothing else. But Mage has a rusty horn. <laughs> well, you you don't just put him on the rusty horn and say, I guess I have to I have to play this different because he has rusty horn. Yeah, of course you do. We, we see the both hands. Oh, yeah. See, we're smart like that. Yeah. Why isn't Hype just mm. commentating the game he's playing? He should. He sounds like um, the dude from Suits. Does he sound like that? Yeah. The uh, Like the main guy? Or? No, 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 no. Not the main guy. The cat guy. The cat guy? Yeah. Like the, the guy that's like got big mm. teeth, like a horse? Yeah, yeah. Exactly. Okay. Like this dude. He really has similar voice to, to, to this to, to I'm this gonna go. I'm gonna have to go talk to him, man, and, and check that out. I can't remember Recorded. what that guy's name is. So Rusty home to help us go. And go face for fall. What to do? What to do? Yeah. Oh, wait. Do you free fall? Oh, uh, whoops. Oh. Crip. Crip. What? I don't know, man. Things are moving really slow. I thought, I thought there was time to like not click stuff. Let me click the second. Like no, me. if you do that, it crashes. I think. Really? Okay. Yeah, I, I think that's what happened it. before. I'll get back in. Because we were trying to do that earlier, I'm and sorry. it just wasn't working. Well, everyone we knows that. There's I was, a second I way. was mm -hmm. responsible for seeing seeing Zayle's cards, and I failed you. Oh, sorry. You had to say sorry. Um, Zaley basically had nothing. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Oh, look! Top deck up. Woof, woof. Uh, that's still... Wait. That's... That, that kind of gives him a turn. Unless... One out of four. Two Frostbolts, two Fireballs. And, uh, Blast Mage, too. So five. So five options to get the evil next turn. He has eight. What's the last card? We don't know. Oh, never mind. Cogmaster is not it. So you have now you have to kill the Arcane Golem. And ping the hound. Yeah. And uh, drop the Whirring Blade and think about dropping the Cogmasters. Mm. Because if this, if there would be a second unleash the hounds, you can die. Yeah? I don't think you put him on second unleash though, the way this game has gone. <laughs> You'd have to top deck that. Oh, mirror entity. So, no. <laughs> He's bluffing ice block. Oh, <laughs> vapor, is that what that vaporize. Is? Oh man. Oh, vaporize. That would be a sick play here. Yeah, there's actually quite a few draws here for uh, for Zilli. Ah, uh, well, he deals five points of damage. I wonder. So he needs quick shot. Wolf Rider, oh, if you play Cogmaster, master, uh, yeah, he has a lot. becomes another one. Yeah, you, you can't play the Cogmaster. You should have played the part to deal one more points of one more point yes. of damage. Yes, yeah. you're completely right about that. So the exhaustion hits. Yeah, very true. It's really hard to play at an offline events like uh, people. Yeah. What's he get? What's he get? That is uh, not it. it. And so that's it. hyped will advance. No, yeah. no, he can kill off the guy and get a doomsday. Okay, you're right. But he didn't go for it. Yeah, he didn't actually try it. He could have won. He didn't have, he didn't have yeah, you're right. Yeah. You're right. That definitely was a mistake. Yeah. I yeah. wish we could see what was inside of that. Yeah, now the ch spectator mode. Check it. And you'd like, just move it around and yeah. open it. You just hold What's it. Inside? What's inside? What's yeah, inside? You <laughs> right click and watch, <laughs> you know? Right click pop. Yeah. Wow, that was very close. Yeah. Very it was.